Okay, Sagittarius. So this is going to be a reading for you guys for the month of July 2019. This is going to be all about what you're not expecting to happen this month, okay? So this is going to be like a heads up for any sort of things that may come up this month. And we're going to get straight into it, okay, guys? Thank you guys so much for your constant support, likes, and shares. And if you are new, definitely make sure you hit that subscribe button if you do enjoy this reading or if you want to check out my other ones in the future all right so what are my Sagittarius not expecting to happen this month what are they not expecting to happen and what are some things that I can give them a heads up on for the month of July 2019 what is the energy they're not expecting to run into this month and guys, please keep in mind this is a general reading, so everything I say in this reading may or may not resonate with you. If you do want a more personal reading, all of that information will be listed below for you. And let's go ahead and get straight into it. So right off the bat, I have the five of swords that really wanted to make itself known to me. So we're going to leave that out here, okay? Sagittarius, what are they not expecting to happen this month for the month of July 2019? I'm going to just start the base off of this reading and then I'm just going to keep pulling cards if I feel compelled to. This is a freestyle reading. <clears throat> so Sagittarius, what I'm seeing for what you're not expecting to happen this month. For a lot of you guys, this may be, cent may be centered around family. Um, and also your sense of happiness. So what I'm seeing here for a lot of you guys, a lot of like, okay, okay. Certain people who may have played mind games with you over like years, time, months, whatever, however long you may have been dealing with people who may have been playing, playing mind games, they will slowly but surely start revealing either those mind games that they've been playing, um, with you or they'll actually like walk away, like stop associating themselves with you um, after just really getting done with the battle of either you guys constantly having arguments or just having to play mind games. And with this, I feel like this person, like I said, will either just stop associating themselves with you or their true colors as far as them actually being a manipulator or them playing mind games will be very clear to you, okay? For some of you guys, this could be an air sign, a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. Doesn't have to be. But moving past that, um, for a lot of you guys, yes, people who play mind games will be revealed to you. Um, for some of you guys is why I am seeing that a lot of you guys will be trying to make some sort of plans or you guys will be faced with the, um, the need to make some plans for the long term, especially when it comes to, um, for some of you guys like living arrangements for others of you, this is like travel. And for some of you guys as well, this is you actually having to look at the long term when it comes to, again, some sort of family situation you may be stuck in. For some of you guys, a marriage or you needing to actually like travel. And for some of you guys, this may be something that you have to do that's in your best good or your, your highest good, excuse me, your highest good. Um, for your emotional well-being for some of you guys some moves that you need to make this month or you're planning to make this month are going to be in your highest good emotionally especially if this is cutting ties with someone who you know there may have been extra people attached to that connection um for some of you guys as well if you are traveling you may meet someone so that is an opportunity there okay Another thing I am seeing for some of you guys, you may try to end up working things out with somebody who may be a little emotionally immature. This person may be a water sign or this person may be younger in energy or like I said, just emotionally immature. All right. Or somebody who doesn't really know how to really be emotionally, I guess, I don't want to say giving, but like somebody who has an issue with really being present emotionally. 
All right, this may be a Pisces. For some of you guys, if you are dealing with somebody who's like this, you do need to use your intuition. There may be a reason for that, especially if this is a Libra. <clears throat> Um, for some of you guys, going back to the whole family thing, if this is speaking about some sort of marriage that you're in, I would definitely stay away from verbal disputes from your partner this month because that could result into some issues down the line. Um, and for some of you guys as well, if there is this immaturity within your marriage as far as like you guys having verbal disputes and not being able to... <clears throat> move move past that and actually work things out there may be a need for you guys to really like sit down with each other and see where things are at within your relationship because if you guys can't work things out like amicable adults in your marriage um without like going off on each other that's not going to be good for your um for your well-being so some of you guys you really do need to go within about this <clears throat> and sorry guys my throat is a little weird okay <laughs> Um, but moving past that, a lot of you guys, um, I'm just seeing a lot of stuff surrounding family. For some of you guys, you could be wanting more for your family unit financially. Like if you are a mother and you may have kids um with like your husband or whatnot or you guys are just married you could want more financially for your marriage or your connection you could be like taking time to really think about um what to do financially for that so that may be the energy you're in moving towards the end of the month but a lot of you guys this is centered around you really trying to solidify a sense of security for a family you may be wanting to start a family that you're already in right now or for some of you guys you could be having family issues and feeling as if you need to solidify yourself as far as a home okay again only take what does apply to you in this reading okay um what i am seeing though a lot of you guys i am seeing accomplishments will come to you as well if you have been putting work in for some time like if you are someone who's been doing some some really hardcore work as far as like Working hard on something for years or really investing yourself emotion emotionally into something for years that um, for some of you guys can make money. I feel like there may be an opportunity <clears throat> for that to actually come through financially. Excuse me, guys. I'm sorry. I'm getting really choked up. But there is a way for you guys to really get financial um, growth from this or again some sort of recognition recognition. But for some of you guys, you really do need to make sure that you are being strategic this month and not focusing on disappointments um or things that haven't worked out in the past some of you guys as well you may not see this coming but somebody may try to reconcile with you from your past again this may be somebody from your childhood or somebody who you may have had kids with for some of you guys is a younger fire sign or somebody who is just younger in energy, I feel like this person is going to try to communicate with you. This could be, again, a fire sign, air sign, water sign. I'm really seeing all the signs right now. But this is definitely somebody who broke your heart. And this person will be trying to clear things up with you this month. Um, Another thing you may not be expecting to happen, you may have an opportunity to really express how you emotionally feel as well to someone especially if they hurt you you are definitely gonna have the chance to speak your mind for some of you guys this person may travel to come see you or you may travel to go see them this doesn't have to be like long distance travel like somebody flying to you this could be just driving to come see you but through this communication through this um like travel this may bring a level of confusion so for my Sagittarius out there, if you know you're dealing with somebody who is not really giving you clear and definitive um, ideas as to where this is going, or for some of you guys, you have no idea which direction this is going in, but you feel like stuck to a situation, you do need to, like I said, confront 
this dissatisfaction you do have going on with the situation here. Um, so yeah, I think that's pretty much it for this reading, um, as far as to what you guys are not expecting to happen. If you did enjoy this reading, definitely please make sure you like this video and comment below. And so sorry about my voice. <laughs> guys, these readings do take a lot out of me. And yeah, I'm going to talk to you guys later. If you do want a personal reading with me, that information will be listed below. Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye, Sages.